From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Tuesday, January 19th, 2016. In the news, the second regular session of the 29th Alaska Legislature will convene in the Senate at 11 a.m. today with the state budget expected to be the main focus. The road to a solution could be rocky with differing ideas for how to help close the hole and the difficult choices that could significantly impact state services. Senator John Coghill told us yesterday that the first budget overview is next week, which will set the stage for the budget discussions as they begin moving forward. Governor Bill Walker wants to look at the impacts that Alaska can expect to its villages and coastline from climate change. Walker says people can agree or disagree on the cause of climate change, but says Alaska is dealing with the effects now. He notes the case of Kivalina, a native village threatened by erosion. He says there's a lot of attention placed on discussing the impacts on Alaska, but not much about doing anything about it. And yesterday, the J.P. Jones Community Development Center celebrated Martin Luther King Jr. Day by opening their doors to the public with free legal advice. Lawyers, along with students from law classes, answered questions and gave advice to a number of individuals seeking help with subjects ranging from Medicare and child custody to divorce and Social Security. The project has been going on for years now and fortunately never has problems recruiting volunteers to assist the needy with their legal issues. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather to wrap up. About an inch of snow possible today. Highs 5 to 15 above and maybe some gusty winds. Tonight mostly cloudy, scattered snow showers. Lows 0 to 5 below, maybe a little warmer in the hills. Tomorrow mostly cloudy, highs 0 to 5 above. Extended outlook, mostly cloudy through the weekend. Highs 0 to 5 Thursday and Friday, 5 to 10 Saturday and Sunday. Lows should stay around 5 to 10 below. The air index is holding at moderate in Fairbanks and North Pole and the Aurora forecast is active. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. And don't forget, you can sign up for our breaking news text alerts. Text the word breaking to 33733. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.